Hey there, I'm Psychic Zombie or Jigs, and this is some different gameplay from what you normally see on my channel. It's Gotham City Imposters. It's a really fun game. I would highly recommend getting it. It's only fifteen dollars and pretty different from what I'm used to. It's like nice and new and fun for me. The guns and everything are cool. The only thing that I don't like is that because it's like a, an arcade game or like a downloadable game that not a lot of people play it so matchmaking is pretty slow like I'll sometimes I'll be waiting 15 minutes to get into a game but that's not a big deal enough about that if you're already one of the lucky 24 <laughs> subscribers you may have noticed that I haven't uploaded in about a week I'm really sorry for the inactivity I would like to I mean I would like to post a video once a week you know if not more frequently but I'm busy sometimes, and I had a really busy, like, two or so weeks at school. I had lots of work to do, and, you know, on the computer and stuff. So hopefully you understand why I wasn't uploading anything. And another thing that I'll say is that if I sound a little different from my videos, it's because I stayed up all night with no sleep at all. And this is because my sleep schedule is really bad and I'm gonna try to fix it because my plan is to basically stay up all night one night so that, that I can go to sleep whenever I need to the next night so far it seems okay I stayed up all night last night trying to you know get that figured out right now I'm not really as much tired out of like exhaustion as I am just lazy and really feel like sleeping I'll be going to bed at like 10 so I can get up at 9 without problems <laughs> Excuse me, I had to clear my throat. I've been watching just a lot of TV to pass the time, really. Trying not to fall asleep. It is really not a big deal. And I'm trying to avoid being hungry because. Ugh, excuse me again. I'm trying to avoid being hungry because whenever I get hungry and I don't eat, that's when I sleep. <clears throat> and there isn't, uh, like, any food that I can just, like, make in my house with me right now. So, I'm kind of like stuck. I'm waiting for lunch. It's like 10 o'clock right now. I'm going to be eating at about 11. So, after that, it'll probably be just me watching TV. And, <clears throat> man, I wish I had better things to talk about. It seems like really sad to me that staying up all night is pretty much the highlight of my week <laughs> that I talk about. It just... <clears throat> man, I really have a... <clears throat> Swear to God, as soon as I start talking is whenever my throat starts doing whatever. Anyway, so now that the side topics are out of the way, what I really wanted to talk about is Borderlands 2. Yesterday, I saw the Borderlands 2 launch trailer. It was on the front page of YouTube, which, yes, it was cool. And I joy puked my face off. <laughs> It was, you know, I'm so excited. If you know me, then you probably know that I'm a huge fan of the Borderlands franchise. Because Borderlands was the game that got me into gaming. I mean, I played games before Borderlands, but Borderlands was the first game that I played, you know? It's the only game that I've gotten 100% of the achievements for. It's the first game that I just, like, got, I spent really like way too much of my time on Borderlands. I got like all the side quests done, I got the main story done, I got like there are four characters that you can play as. I got both of the four all of the four characters like max leveled out with you know like all the stuff and everything. It's spent way too much time on that game, but it was awesome and Borderlands is what really got me into gaming. So it's pretty much the thing that started kind of like what I am now is really because I'm part of this cool like YouTube community kind of and a lot of my best friends are people who I met playing games and I wouldn't be as big of a gamer as I am if it were not for Borderlands. I would have never gotten into like Call of Duty or any of that if it had not been for Borderlands. <sighs> and so I will be pre-ordering Borderlands 2, and, you know, I'm gonna, you know, get the whatever thing with it. I 
the for the GameStop thing, it's like for the extra five dollars for pre-order, and you get like a key to a chest and some guns and stuffing else. I don't know if they're gonna like release something else that has other cooler stuff in it. That would be cool because I would have no problem at all spending plus a hundred dollars for you know some cool Borderlands stuff, just because that's the like that's the franchise that I will choose to waste all of my money. <laughs> just like shut up and take my money. <laughs> is what it is. Ah, and man, this trailer was so cool. They're like robots and just like a bazillion guns. And it's, ah, it's gonna be something else. It's gonna be my favorite game this year. And after I watched the trailer, I got you know like thinking like I did in. I have known since before I you know started commentating that I had the intention of eventually doing let's plays. So I didn't know if it would be a good idea to do a Borderlands Let's Play in honor of Borderlands 2 coming out. Because, you know, to tell me what you think of the idea. Because I freaking love the game and I would love an excuse to go back and play it some more. But it's like, right now, it's just like, I, I can't, you know, like with the limited amount of time I have, I don't have time to play you know, a single player game a lot. Unless it's for a reason that I can make up, such as YouTube or something. And, you know, it just, ah, uh, it's just, more than it's too, it's gonna be so good. And I know that it's, you know, been announced for a while, but I mean, it's like, the trailer's the first thing that's like, you, what you know it's gonna be like, there were robots, and there were like, the cool, like, the guy with like, the two guns, and there's, the invisible dude who like stabbed the guy in the nuts or whatever and then there's the chick who did her thing and the dude who has like a turret on his back like rocket launcher it's gonna be an awesome game can't wait it's gonna be like ugh, I just I heard about it and I like got up and I like punched the air and I did like Napoleon dynamite kicks and shit it was it was incredible for me I was just like so happy and I'm gonna be so happy when I get I'm gonna go like the midnight release I'm gonna do everything it's gonna be like the coolest thing ever and Joker's win I gameplay's wrapping up uh, tell me what you think of the idea if you're watching this and you even kind of enjoyed the game or the gameplay or my commentary hopefully uh, please subscribe it would really make me happy if I could get to 30 subs before my next video so anyway thanks for watching and have a nice day